Hey everybody, what's up? Devin here, back with another video. Today, I'm finally getting on the hand uh, for a showcase, so I apologize for not recording for a little while. It's, I've been sick for the past two weeks now, so I haven't really been able to record anything. I've just been, you know, posting memes and stuff. Anyways, uh, it's another stand showcase finally. It's been a while since we actually did one. I'm joined by my friend Alex here. Say hello. Yes. Yes. I'm, I'm hello, yes. That is hello. I'm hello. <laughs> Anyways, let's get on with it. So the first move is called Erasure Combo. Um, it's basically, you know, just a standard E-move, except it doesn't do a barrage. It's just, you know, hits you three times with um, its, uh, you know, right hand. The hand is actually really powerful, which I will get onto later. But anyways, on to the next move. The next move is called Heavy Erasure. You press R. It's basically the heavy hitting move. It basically insta-kills or gets someone half health. So <laughs> on to the final v PvP move. So the next move is called Leg Erasure. You press F, you have to wait a second, and you know, you cripple them. You keep, you keep on crippling me with this. <laughs> so it lasts, I, it lasts for about 10 seconds. They can't move very far and they can't attack you. We're All you have to do is hit them with that and you basically win the fight. Yeah, it's an instant, yeah. it's an instant win. The next move is called Erasure Travel. You just press V, you know, you come over here, you're like, yo, what's good? Erasure Travel is only a, uh, what's it called? A travel move. You can't, it's like, you know, for getting away from opponents, you can't just, you know, it, you can't just, you know, hit them with it. Okay. The next move is called the Racer Hops. Hold Z, and you can uh, use up to three hand swipes, and you can go really far with it. It's really good, you know, it's really well used. Anyways, now that all the moves are done, let's move on to the 1v1. Okay, uh, go. <laughs> Wait, what? I was trying to hit you with a... <laughs> <laughs> I win, I'm so good. <laughs> so overall, the hand is actually a really good stand. It's kind of ugly looking. They didn't really do a very good job on like the facial features and stuff. It has a B in destructive power, a B in speed, and a C in durability. So the problem, which makes sense in the canon, it's really slow. So if you want, so if you want to get land a good hit, you're gonna have to uh, like really be near the person. If you're nowhere near, if you're like maybe even a foot away or like a couple, you know, pixels away, you're not gonna land a hit. Second of all, I mean, they really didn't put much time. I know the stand took like what two months to come out. They have three combat moves. They need to fix that. If they, if they, if you have three combat moves, it's not gonna be a fun stand to play with. It's a cool stand to use, but it's not very fun to play with because of how just utterly boring it is it has three different moves that you can choose from so it's really boring <laughs> but overall i think it's a pretty cool stand they did a pretty good a pretty good job on the design apart from the facial features fix the moves and then release it you know re-release it hopefully it'll be better anyways hope you guys enjoyed feel free to leave a like and sub if you're new i'll see you guys next time peace